time we did some earth moving with the foot peg. Oh, now, we munched the brake lever. So what happens when a butter soft brake lever goes into the grass? That's why the, uh, why the case breaks on them too. You can even see it. It scratched my case there a little bit. It's got to get it out far enough that it's not going to... The case. The case isn't leaking, so we're good there. Today we're going to be installing some aluminum engine covers on a KTM 690 Enduro. Let's get some really uh, strong brake cleaner and a rag and make sure you clean the surface of the case really, really well. It's probably a good idea to do that on the cover as well, just to make sure there's not any residue or anything. I'm choosing to use this uh, E6000. It's a uh, just a really strong adhesive and the reason I did that is because it withstands temperatures up to 180 degrees and most of them that I could find would not do that and I just wanted to make sure that uh, it stayed on there really well because I have no intentions of taking it back off so I don't really care how hard it sticks on there because as you can probably see I already damaged my case and cleaned and prepped that all up so that I can stick it on and never take it off. I think I'm going to run three beads. I'm going to run one right on the edge so that nothing falls down inside from the top, water and grit and stuff. I think I'll run one right on the crease and then I'll run a little one through the middle. Okay, I left that set up for a couple minutes and now we're going to try and very carefully Stick it on there without uh, touching the glue too much. See if we can get it lined up. Perfect. Now we'll just let that set up and uh, call it good. Okay, same business on the uh, ignition side. We're going to get a nice clean rag and some good uh, brake cleaner. And we're going to wipe down any uh, residue, silicone spray, anything that uh, might be in our engine cover. Good, a good surface for the uh, adhesive to stick to. So you can see how much crap came off of there. Uh, honestly, this is probably a little bit of clear coat and uh, you know all kinds of stuff too. But uh, oxidative uh, paint or whatever. This bike's a few years old, so I'm sure that some of that is uh, actually the uh, surface coating. Brake, brake cleaner is pretty tough stuff. All right, I've let it set up for a few minutes. You can see I got a little bead of juice around uh, everywhere where dirt might enter, and we're gonna drop her into place. Very, very, very carefully line it up. Lightly press. See it oozing in there a little bit. That's okay. Roll it into place. That's the wrap up for the install today. Uh, if you like KTM 690 wrenching videos, check out uh, the pop ups over here somewhere and consider subscribing to the channel. I love the 690. I love riding the 690. I like working on the 690. So uh, if you guys like 690 content, um, subscribe, hit the notification bell. You know, hit the like button maybe if you like this. Take care.